Accountant General of the Federation, Ahmed Idris, says the federal government has returned the 4.2 million euro Iburi loot to the Delta State government. The AGF disclosed this on Tuesday when he appeared before the House of Representatives Ad Hoc Committee on Assets Recovery. Ahmed Idris also appealed to the House to give the Treasury single account a legal backing for it to be more effective. There is nothing either in the title as, uh, I mean, indicating a previous correspondence from the office of the Attorney General, neither is there anything in the opening paragraph making reference to a letter from the office of the Attorney General. Mr. Chairman, I humbly request that if there is a, I mean, a originating correspondence from my office, it should be made available to me. The Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation, Abu Bakar Malami, who also appeared before the Committee on Illegal Spending of 30 billion Naira recovered funds, denying the allegations. We open the accounts, we maintain the accounts, we are custodians, and we rely on authority of the Presidency through the Honorable Minister of Finance to make disbursements out of such accounts. With the emergence of TSA, Honorable Committee, the Consolidated Revenue Account is now one. And it is a single account, which has subdivisions, sub-accounts, but which are linked together. Linked together operationally, and we can see for the purpose of consolidation, aside of the individual balances in the account, what is there, you know, as an overall balance, reflecting the consolidated revenue, for account, uh, revenue account. The Haddock Committee was mandated by the House to investigate the status of all recovered loots, movable and immovable assets from 2002 to 2020.